Hey guys, today we are talking about the brand new Jet Boil Flash. Now the Flash has always been about lightning fast boil times and the new model continues that by shaving an entire minute off the previous version's boil time of two minutes and 30 seconds. Now that means you can now boil 16 ounces of water in just 100 seconds. The base plate on the new Flash, which you can see right here, is made of aluminum, and that means it's an ounce lighter than previous models. Also makes for an easier on-off connection than the older model. The new Flash also has a thermochromatic heat indicator that changes color for safety and fuel efficiency. And it tells you exactly when the water is hot so you don't waste any fuel. It still comes with a one liter flux ring cooking cup and insulated cozy, but it's also been updated with a more ergonomic design and an improved lid for better fit and function. It's got a drink through lid with a built in strainer and the bottom cover doubles as a measuring cup and a bowl. The Flash also has a reliable push button igniter and it puts out 9,000 BTUs of power. The new Flash will let you boil 10 liters of water with just one of these 100 gram jet power cans. There are also new Flash Cozy color options for 2018, including Carbon Black, Matrix, Jet Cam, and Wilderness. And you can opt for the new Flash Java Kit, which you can see right here. The new Flash is also compatible with other accessories like the hanging kit, pot support, flux ring frying pan and pot, and utensils. Introducing Gas One's line of butane camp stoves. Made to be lightweight and versatile, they're great for camping, backpacking, and emergency preparedness. They produce an ultra-high BTU output and come equipped with an easy-to-use piezoelectric ignition mechanism. They take a single 8-ounce butane cartridge. Before use, make sure the stove is placed on a flat, sturdy surface. Part 1. Installing the butane canister. Make sure the canister locking lever is in the unlocked position. If the adjustable dial isn't in the off position, the user will not be able to lock the canister into place. Open the gas canister cover and line the tip of the butane canister with the regulator notch in the canister compartment. Do not use the burner if it is leaking, damaged, or not operating properly. Part 2. Operation Push down on the canister level to the fuel lock position. If the canister isn't connected properly, you will hear a hissing sound. Warning! When connecting the canister, make sure no other source of heat or flame are present. Part 3. Lighting the stove Turn the control knob counterclockwise until you hear a click, which indicates that a spark is being produced. Adjust the flame to the desired heat level with the control knob. Part 4. Turning off the burner Turn the ignition knob to the off position to cut off the fuel supply. Wait until the flame is completely extinguished before proceeding. Next, raise the canister lock lever to unlock and remove the gas canister from the canister compartment. Do not leave the canister inside the burner when it is not in use. Part 5. Storage To properly store the unit, make sure the stove is cool first. Double check to make sure the burner is completely cooled down before stowing away. This is our Gigapower stove. Introduced in 1999, it was Snowpeak's first entry into the backpacking market. It's our most iconic and best-selling backcountry stove.
the new Pocket Rocket Deluxe Stove is packed with premium features. Carrying forward the legacy of MSR's best-selling Pocket Rocket Stoves, this deluxe model has a larger burner, lights with the push of a button, and was engineered for fast boil times across a wider range of temperatures. In the backcountry, colder weather or low fuel cause a stove to run slower. To combat this, we gave the deluxe model an internal pressure regulator. This regulator allows the stove to maintain fast boil times across a range of temperatures. We wanted the stove to work well on cold mornings or when your canister might be running low on fuel. Because of the built-in regulator, the deluxe model makes an excellent choice for three season adventures. The stove also comes equipped with piezo push start lighting for fast, easy ignition. This piezo is the most durable one we've ever built. We internally routed the wire and set the electrode deep within the burner head for maximum protection. The piezo was designed to match the Pocket Rocket's legendary durability and offer many seasons of use. With its broad burner, the Pocket Rocket Deluxe generates a powerful flame despite its compact size. And the burner's lip adds wind resistance, increasing efficiency. Precision flame adjustment allows you to go from torch all the way down to simmer and the stainless steel pot supports fold down to create an impressively small pack size. At just 83 grams or 2.9 ounces, the Pocket Rocket Deluxe packs in a ton of performance. For backpackers pushing the limits of three seasons, it offers one of the best overall cooking experiences. With our two burner regulated propane stoves, you'll never have to choose between frying bacon and making coffee again. Two 10,000 BTU stainless steel burners provide plenty of cooking power for the whole campsite. These stoves come with a pressure regulator for easy control of your fuel and run on a 16.4 ounce disposable propane cylinder. The propane cylinder is sold separately. We've attended to all the details, like a detachable lid for oversized pots and pans, two attached windscreens, a heavy duty removable steel grate, and an easy to clean solid surface. The entire stove is coated with a baked on enamel finish for long lasting use and is available in both a blue and silver finish. Hey guys, today we're talking about the Jetboil Genesis Base Camp System. Now this thing is the world's first base camp cook system that will totally change the way you cook in the backcountry. So the Genesis Base Camp System is basically a super fast and efficient two burner cook stove that comes with a five liter pot and a 10 inch frying pan. It all nests together in a compact package and weighs just nine pounds. So first let's talk about the Genesis stove itself. Now it's incredibly powerful with two 10,000 BTU burners and it'll boil a liter of water in just over three minutes. But it's also incredibly efficient. In fact, one of these one pound propane bottles will let you boil 48 liters of water. Now on top of that, it has Jetboil's unbeatable simmer control, thanks to their patented regulator valve technology. So you can cook perfectly golden brown French toast for breakfast in the morning, and then rapidly boil water for fettuccine at night, all on the same stove. Now each burner has a super reliable lever igniter for easy lighting, and the whole stove folds together for really easy storage. It's also JetLink compatible. So JetLink basically allows you to connect the Genesis to other stoves and accessories without the need for extra regulators and fuel sources. The Genesis Base Camp system comes with a 5 liter flux pot and a 10 inch frying pan for eco-friendly non-stick cooking. And then the whole system fits right in this great carry bag, which has a separate padded compartment for the fuel regulator and padded walls so nothing gets beat up. So with the Genesis Base Camp system, you're really getting the ultimate camp kitchen in a bag. And thanks to JetLink, you can expand that kitchen depending upon how many people you've got in your group. Here's a quick guide on how to use your Coleman Classic propane stove. Always place the stove on a sturdy, flat surface. Open the lid and position the wind guards as desired. Make sure the pot support, which is the metal grate, is in place and both knobs are in the off position. Take the regulator and screw it into the stove until it is hand tight. Remove the plastic cap from the top of the propane bottle and screw the propane bottle into the regulator until it is hand tight. Make sure the propane bottle is tilted with the top facing up. 
hold a lighted match or butane lighter near the burner and turn the knob so that the burner is on. Adjust the knob until the flame is blue with a hint of yellow on the tips. Repeat the previous steps to light the second burner. When finished, turn all burner control knobs to off, remove the propane bottle and regulator. Once everything cools, clean the stove, place the gold end of the regulator into the hole provided for secure storage, fold the wind guards, and store away. For more information, visit Coleman.com or download the Coleman app.